how is this not considered like terrorism or illegal or anything for the Israeli government to openly announce and go through with it to steal land from the West Bank? Uh, FYI, the West Bank is controlled by the Palestinian Authority, not Hamas, so the excuse of Hamas cannot be used here. Uh, under international law, an occupying government cannot make settlements in occupied territory, uh, which uh, the Israeli government has been doing for a long time now. We got 140 illegal settlements and over 700,000 illegal settlers in the West Bank that are being armed and funded by the Israeli government. Uh, I'm curious, if the Palestinians decided to defend themselves against the Israeli terrorists, will they be labeled as terrorists themselves? And does that mean terrorist, uh, terrorist means nothing when people defending themselves are labeled as the terrorists? Even as the U.S. Secretary of State Antony Blinken uh, made his, his visit to Israel, his latest visit, the Israeli government announced that it was um, declaring state land 800 hectares, that's nearly 2,000 acres of land in the occupied West Bank, in the north of the Jordan Valley, near the uh, illegal Israeli settlement uh, um, in the north. Yeah, everybody in the world knows that the settlements that the Israeli government builds in the West Bank are illegal under international law. And does the Israeli care? No. North Jordan Valley. Um, so they're declaring that state land. What does that mean? It means that it can be sold to Israeli settlers. It can't be claimed as Palestinian private land anymore. And this is against the, the fundamental... Well, so the Israeli government can just decide that land that doesn't belong to them belongs to them. And deny Palestinians the ability to own that land. How is that not uh, illegal? How is that not, like, terrorist? Terrorism. How is that not, you know, uh, fascism to where a government thinks they get to steal any land that they want? Mentals of um, international law, but announcing this, the hard right Israeli finance minister, Bezalel Smotrich, said um, that they were working to promote settlement and work throughout the whole country. He is one of the... The, the Israeli government has no worries about breaking international law because they know they can break international law and have no repercussions because the United States is going to protect them. That's why they're so open about the genocide against the Palestinians in Gaza and about stealing land in the West Bank. The ministers who believes that the occupied West Bank, which he terms Judea and Samaria, using the biblical terms widely used in Israel, uh, should be part of Israel. So that in a defined. Yeah, religious nuts think that because God told people, well, supposedly told people because God doesn't exist, uh, thousands of years ago that land belongs to a certain group of people, that these people nowadays can go out and murder people and steal land. That's something that the Nazis claimed that God told them that land belongs to them so that they can go. So they went out and just murdered a bunch of people. Defiant stunt timing that announcement with uh, Anthony Blinken's visit shows just perhaps in how little mood for compromise.